soul work, which is work having to do with the deepest waters of our human experience, the very core sense of who we are and what we're about, the very core of our human experience. Some of you know I'm publishing a weekly blog, Becoming a Son, on my website. I wrote a piece for this coming week, I think it'll be published, and I'd like to read it to you. It's short, based on a quote from my book. I won't re read the quote, only the paragraphs following it. This is on soul work. It is clear that the soul of humanity is undergoing a huge change in this era. The outer forms of human culture show it, our politics, our human relations, our health, and much more. And we can each feel it happening in the depths of our own soul. Here is what I have learned about the process of human transformation. It is always easier when you learn to let the deep waters of your soul be warmed by the radiance of the sun. This is the warming power of love within you. It is the power of all the atoms in your body and all atoms everywhere. It is your own fire in the belly and the radiance of the sun in our solar system. And it is the sun present in all the people you know. When we expo expose the deep waters to that warming power, what is hard and frozen melts. And what is melted can flow and reshape. It can change easily to take on the forms of the next stage of our human evolution. Ice doesn't flow, it breaks. Cold hard steel is brittle. No matter how hard it is pounded by the blacksmith, it cannot take on the shape he has in his mind's eye. Steel warmed in the hot coals of the smith's fire becomes malleable. So if you know your life is calling you to change, if you know you are part of the body of humankind who's being called to its next stage of conscious evolution, how will you expose the deepest waters of your soul to the warmth of the sun? Because only then will those waters melt. This is the soul work we are called to today. We are becoming a sun.